Uh, medium maker back again, uh, just starting a new type of plant. This here is a California Wonder bell pepper, and uh, decided to start some. And I did it on a heated mat, and I put down what I thought was about 12 seeds, and I came up with 15. So I tapped put down 15 or more, and 15 came up. So pretty good success rate with the mat. Uh, I had a little nutrient solution in there glued it down a little bit and that's what they started in and it seems to like it and it's used to it now so another the variation is I started some and a little bit of water solution these are sure to grow pods <clears throat> if you've ever heard I don't know if you can tell the plant on the left towards the center you can see algae uh, which I will take that out of there before I pot it in anything else but these are going to be hydroponic pots grown in coffee cans with uh, aerator stones. And what that looks like is this. This is my hydroponic coffee can pepper. I don't have air to it right now because it's noisy and I couldn't move it around. So uh, to get too close it's going to be a little bit blurry. But let me show you something. It's only been in there for three days, and if you can make it out, I'll try to show you, you can see the roots coming down, which is pretty impressive. Uh, as with these over here, I ripped off the top because that seems to be the algae portion where the algae collects on the sure to grow, I guess you call them cubes. And uh, you're supposed to stick them in another sure to grow cube, but I didn't do that. I had hydrogen. So I ripped the top off, <clears throat> put hydrogen in it, and stick it in my little pot. And down in the pot, I'll show you. I don't know if you can make this out. See that very large air stone? It's a gray one. Puts out smaller bubbles and lots more of it. And from my lesson learned from the tomato hydroponic, I put it in the center. So she gets lots of bubbles. I uh, wish I could turn it on right now, but I can't. So these guys will go in there, and not in this particular pot, but they'll each have their own coffee can. And I'll gain them off of the same pump. And I've got a nice pump that has two outlets. So we'll have a little bit of uh, competition here between the naturally potted peppers and my hydroponic peppers. And if I let it go long enough, I'm sure we'll find out a that will uh, win out. And the nice thing about the way I did this one, also learned my lesson, is I put it in a neti pot. I can stick this in a five gallon bucket next if I want to. Or I can take all three and get like a uh, uh, Rubbermaid container that's uh, big and square and stick them in there and also have a heater in with them if need be. So looking forward to that and uh, since I get some more lights set up and another area to put them in that's what I'll be doing so by midweek I should have all three of these in pots like this so stay tuned it's a pretty easy hydroponic shop free can airlines cheap air stones two bucks hydrogen three bucks for a pretty big bag you could probably do about 10 15 of these guys with it and uh, does pretty good and the nutrients are about uh, $19.99 and they last seemingly forever I'm still on the same nutrients not even put a dent in it so any questions comments uh, please subscribe thank you